see how there's a female end inside of it that the screw goes into I don't, I don't know exactly what to call that but um, and you kinda gotta play around with it until you get it where it needs to be and then get it in flip the gun over and use this tightening knob to uh, or use the other screw and you have that in place now we'll go up behind it and uh, go ahead and sink all these screws into place And as soon as they snug up, I, I usually let them go, call them done. two accessory rails and we'll put them guys on and like with, with the other things I usually kind of just work opposite I'll do the, the first and the third or the third and the first kind of thing and I just kind of half sync them And then I'll go ahead and uh, tighten them all the way, set them home. Like so. We'll flip this guy around and repeat the process. But it, it, the, the main problem that I have with it tends to be when I'm, uh, you know, putting the bolt back together and in the trigger guard. It's kind of a pain in the butt. There's a couple of videos around YouTube showing you how to go about doing that the best way. You got to release the, uh, there we go. You got to release the, uh, Uh, the charging handle about half 50% and then uh, the trigger guard will slide out now all I have I have a um, scope mounted on mine and in order to put that on I'll go ahead and install my 
it's my four end on here. It's a vertical grip that uh, has a bipod, so it's pretty cool. It really helps out because it uh, stables the gun, makes the gun stable for when I'm put mounting the uh, scope to it, as you will see in just a second. And you have a put together Mossberg 22 Tactical. I will show you just a second how I put my scope on. Now this still is going to require a little bit of tweaking to, uh, you know, sight in whenever you remove an optic. You have to. Um, basically redo the process of uh, mounting it no. and what I do is I just kinda get it in place This requires a different bit as well. So all in all, you need two different two different uh, attachments to install. Your mind just needs a third because of uh, the scope. But you just need a Phillips, a pointed Phillips head, and what did I do with the other one? Oh, and basically it looks like an Allen wrench adjustment. I don't know the sizes, I just have a uh, universal kit that I use. So they'll, they'll seem to work real well. Mm. Sorry if I'm blocking the view. For you guys, it's and I don't go all the way home again with these either. I usually just, uh, you know, get them happily started, and then uh, you can always come back and tighten them. Just take your time guys, you don't last thing you want to do is strip anything. Especially using a drill like this. Uh, it's not the recommended way of doing it, but I prefer ease in most applications. So there we go. All right, we are home. All right, YouTube, we are officially done with the assembly of the Mossberg 22 Tactical. Uh, I hope this video helped you out and you guys enjoyed it. This is Armin Willen signing out. Remember, protect yourselves and those you love. Have a good day.